Hey everyone, welcome back to this series where I go over these mini SEO case studies where I don't dive too deep into the technicalities, but I just show you the power SEO can have on any business. And in today's video, I want to talk about Eastwood's SEO success, right? So client Eastwood, and they are a US auto parts e-commerce store, which came to us, and I'll explain in a second who is us, with a number of issues, right? And we'll go over the issues in just a second. But I bolded here e-commerce because Doing SEO for e-commerce is completely different from doing SEO for a local business or any other type of SEO like affiliate and all that. E-commerce SEO is a whole beast in and of itself. So I did want to mention this because e-commerce SEO, at least for me, can be quite hard. But let's go over the issues the client had and then the actual business impact, which is of course what matters. So the issues were, first of all, poor technical SEO, right? The site was slow, full of duplicate content, which is a big no-no and had a poor user experience. And this is a big one. And I talk about this often. Um, yes, you can have a site ranking number one, but uh, if the user experience is poor, right? If you, don't, if you don't have clear call to actions where the customers or the potential customers can click to buy or whatever with you, it's quite pointless to be ranking number one, right? Because you're not converting the people that are coming in. So, sorry, I was looking at that. I should be looking at the camera. Sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, poor user experience, optimizing not just for rankings, but optimizing also for conversions and user experience is very, very important. Because again, you can rank number one, but if you're not converting, you might as well not rank number one, right? So very, very important. Then, inefficient internal linking, this is a big one. So the overall strength of the website was not being fully utilized. Link, internal link building is so, so, so important. I'll, I'll risk to say that it is as important as um, external link building or link building to the site. Um, CRO issues, right? Conversion optimization issues on desktop and mobile, poor conversion funnel, meaning no cart abandoned campaigns, no email signups, no email marketing. So they needed a whole revamp in how they were doing their, their business essentially, right? All this resulted in a significant below industry and unprofitable conversion rates. Right, so this isn't just this isn't just about SEO, and most sites that need SEO also need conversion optimizations and the whole business um, redoing. So, but I guess it's also always important to talk about these things because people often think, okay, I just need to rank number one and then I'm, I'm set. No, there's a lot of things you need to do to run a profitable business, like email marketing, for example, optimizing for conversions and all that. Um, but I guess I can talk a bit more about that in another video. Now, what was the business impact of this SEO strategy of fixing all these issues and then building backlinks on top of that, uh, creating content, fixing technical SEO issues? The business impact was a 33% in Google attributed sales, right? Sales coming in from organic search, right? Which is about 700K increase in sales for them. Then a 25% increase in sessions from 260K to 330K, right? All this measured with Google Search Console and Google Analytics, and 100 plus backlinks generated, which of course, as I say always, this has a direct correlation with uh, the impact above and the organic rankings. So by the way, these backlinks that I'm mentioning here are backlinks created by Jackie. He's a seller here on Vetted. He does sell the exact same backlinks. You can grab them here. Um, and by the way, if you use the code, uh, I think he's save five, you can save 5%. I'll leave it in the description as well if you want. But yeah, the backlinks that he's selling here are the same backlinks that he used to to build, uh, build out this strategy. And uh, as you can see here, the revenue growth, uh, this is a screenshot, screenshot sorry, from Google uh, Search Console, Google Analytics, sorry. So a 33% growth, revenue growth in under six months, right? As you can see here, uh, sessions increase, new user increase by 25%, bounce rate increased. This isn't particularly good because, I mean, you want, want to have the lowest bounce rate as possible, but I guess if you're getting more users in, um, you get the higher bounce rate, even though this is a percentage. Uh, but yeah, I guess it is what it is. Uh, transactions, which, which is sorry, what matters, and the revenue is up by 33%. So insanely, insane, sorry, how you can implement an organic SEO strategy and uh, increase revenue by 33% in under six months. Pretty cool. Again, if you wanna grab the links that, I, that were used, you can grab them here. I'll leave a link for this in the description. Uh, for Jackie's links, he has the metrics here. He has some reviews already. Uh, he just joined the platform, so it's quite recent, but you can grab the same links here. And if you want Jackie to build a, or any other person to build a custom tailored strategy to your business, right, on page, off page, technical SEO, you can just go to that and click here on the manage SEO button and you'll be direct, redirected sorry, to this page, which if you click hire SEO talent, just fill out a form and you qualify, we can, we can match you with a professional SEO. There is a minimum $1,000 budget, but if you qualify and if you wanna invest, I do think uh, it can be beneficial. 
And yeah, that's, that's about it. Hopefully you like these ones. I guess I gotta promote before I go this little tool. It's called Campaigns. It essentially gives you vital data to assess the status of your SEO efforts. And what that means is this is a tool that gives you SEO data for your SEO efforts. Really kill rankings, backlinks, top pages, kill rankings, competitors. Uh, it connects direct, directly to Google Search Console, gives you uh, rank change, SEO clicks, like a rank tracker, rank domains, anchors of your backlinks, traffic. Um, and you can even input a competitor's link uh, URL and steal their backlinks, check, check all of your competitors. Pretty cool. I'll leave a coupon in the description for this as well for 50% off if you want to grab it. Um, we wanted to build something that was that people would use 100% of. Because yes, there's a lot of SEO tools out there, but um, often what ends up happening is that you end up using just 10, 20% of the tool. And we wanted to build something that people would use 100% of. So that's why we built this. And also, uh, journalists here, if you um, want to produce content for your SEO efforts, we are developing an I've developed this little tool that works with AI and essentially pumps out SEO optimized articles based on current events, based on current news, right? It's not just going to ChatGPT and saying, write me an article about uh, pool cleaning service. Not that at all, right? We're taking in actual content that's running in the news that's available, that's up to date, running through our prompts, our magic prompts, and our APIs and all that, and creating actual, actually valuable content. You know, you could, excuse me, you can try it out for yourself if you want. Uh, for free, you can just go here, put your URL description, niche, and choose this, put your email, and we'll, we'll allow you, I think it's infinite times, to be honest with you, to try it for free. Uh, you can just use different emails, to be honest with you. Uh, so yeah, try it out if you like it. If you don't, it is what it is. Yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Check out Vetted. Um, I really appreciate you guys watching the videos. Um, thank you, thank you so much, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.